Hey you guys, it's Chef Finest Wine. Welcome back to the channel. If you are new here, please hit the like, subscribe button, and share this video out if you're able to. I'm gonna be making some quick and real easy chicken soup. This is the beginner's way. If you're a beginner, you've never made chicken soup, some quick and easy chicken soup, you wanna learn how, please stay tuned. I'm gonna show you how to do it. I've been taking on all this baggage Adding on so much weight Had me thinking that I was average When you're really the flag We coat our chicken with olive oil We're gonna start seasoning it So you'll need about a tablespoon and a half okay that's just to make sure your seasoning is going to stick to your meat first thing I add to that black pepper about we'll say two teaspoonfuls of black pepper a generous amount okay the next thing we'll add is our hot sauce traditional to add salt and pepper. I don't use a lot of white salt, okay? So we won't be adding any white salt to this recipe. I'm gonna add onion powder. We want all that onion flavor. We do have some separate vegetables that we're gonna add to our recipe. The vegetables that you'll need are onions, I have bell peppers, um, you should add carrots and celery. I'm not gonna add carrots and celery this time. This is uh, one of the seasonings in the store I found, orange pepper. We're gonna see how this tastes for the, with the chicken soup. So we're gonna add about two teaspoonfuls of that, okay? You wanna make sure your chicken is seasoned very, very well. I don't like bland chicken soup. Got to get all that flavor in there. This is our fire smoke seasoning. This uh, dish is not going to take long to cook because it's already kind of late. So we want to make sure that our food is cooked within the 30 minutes that I told you guys. This is onion, no, this is garlic powder, I'm sorry. 30 minutes. We'll add a little lorry seasoning. That's good. And I'm honestly, since I want a little slight kick, I'll add some jerk seasoning to my chicken soup. Okay, now we're gonna start mixing everything.
Yep. Before you dump these vegetables in here, make sure they have been rinsed off. Please, I don't even play like that. These are string beans, sweet peas, corn, carrots. Once the meat, the chicken is almost done, we can separate the meat from the bone and then add our noodles and then the dish should be all complete. Doesn't take long for the vegetables to cook. So you definitely don't want to overcook them. We do have some creamy chicken that we're gonna add. But we're not gonna add that yet. Step is so important. You wanna make sure you have separated all of your meat from the bone. Nobody wants to be chewing on bones. I personally don't mind it, but that's not how you make the soup, okay? So there's no bone left in this recipe, in this dish. Make sure you get your corners here. That's where the flavor is at. We have already added our cream of chicken. Next thing we'll add is our egg noodles. Just giving it a good stir. Get them corners. Since we added some more broth to the soup, we're gonna add some paste. It's called Better Than Bouillon Smoky Chipotle. We're gonna add about a half a tablespoon, okay? Let's go ahead and add that in there. Add some more black pepper. Let me show you guys how we do it back in at the house in the crib back in the day that's how i was taught to make it back then we didn't have that paste though some good old southern chicken soup it's nothing better cream of chicken has already been added Look at that. Look at that. When you're cooking in a Dutch oven, the, the bottom tends to burn a little bit, so make sure you have it on a low heat, all right? We'll be back. Father, help your children. Don't let them fall by the side. them to love one another heaven might find a place in their hearts 
Kajit